to think I'm a, a work in progress, uh, you know, every day. But I would argue that um, some of, some of what has helped me be where I am. Um, I think I'm. I've I've, I've got a very deep uh, sense of self awareness. Mm. I know where I'm strong. I don't I don't need to be told that, uh, and I know where I'm weak. I don't need to be told that. So I I, I encourage this. Um, process of trying to master thyself mm. um, because you can engage the, with the world very honestly. So the continuous st step of um, self-mastery, understanding where you are, because you also do evolve. Mm. What was um, made you successful at 40 might not make you successful at 50. Absolutely. So I'd say, you know, I, I practice my own techniques of self-mastery by having, you know, kind of honest conversations with myself. Mm. Um, I would also argue that I'm very clear um, around the skills and tools I have that can take me into different situations and give me a sense that I can do reasonably well in those situations. Mm. Um, as an example, I said, at the core, I'm, uh, my engineering mindset is about fixing problems mm, mm, and mm. how do you approach problems and, uh, and so forth. So I'm very clear of that uh, tool set um, and, um, and, and, and when I bring them in and therefore I can build a team around me that complements where I lack. Mm -hmm. And I'm always looking for that, being honest with myself that I'm not as good as that person. Mm -hmm. But I think I'm relatively better than most, not always all, in being able to, to integrate mm -hmm. these people. Um, I, practice, I practice quite quite a bit, you know, the art of uh, building and strengthening teams. Um, I've read the book uh, and I try and practice the team of rivals. I've, oh. I've managed teams that are like the team of rivals <laughs> and, uh, you know, lived to, to see the day. Mm -hmm.